I believe in America. I believe in the people of this country. Every time there's a recession, I think all the naysayers, you know, they come forth and, and they say how America is dead and how America, you know, is, is, is a failed formula. The naysayers that, that motherfuck this country, I, I, I really invite them to move to China. Biker's Choice was our very first distributor uh, back in 99-2000. There was a uh, nefarious guy called Skeeter Todd who uh, kept pestering us. We were new to the business. It was uh, we started the business in 98, and the idea of going through a distributor was 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 something we couldn't grasp at the time. But uh, through the insistence of Skeeter Todd. Um, we signed up with Biker's Choice. Biker's Choice has done a lot of good stuff for us over the years. Harley, in 2006, introduced their first six-speed. Um, we introduced our original six-speed back in 1998. In 2006, we thought, oh my God, you know, game over. You know, Harley introduced their six-speed. And uh, what, what, what is poor Bert going to do? Well, that's not the case at all. What has happened with, with Harley introducing the six-speed, it has legitimized everything we've been talking about since 1998. And, and what that really translates into is, is there's millions of bikes I'm guessing maybe two to three million bikes built between 1990 and 2006 that have a five-speed. And uh, those bikes and, and the owners are now riding with people that have the newer bikes with the six-speed. Bottom line is this, bikes from 1990 to 2006 are a huge opportunity for Biker's Choice, Biker's Choice dealers, and Baker Drivetrain.